Welcome back. That was uh, a short musical break, Cindy. And right now we are still on Ziki Talk on the last hour of Church O'Clock Show. And right now I am joined by the hey. It's an honor. You know the, the you know some things I just dreamt of. Wakati ni likuwa kijana ni kikuwa ni kianza ku DJ. I dreamt of meeting these people. And right now I'm having the privilege of having to bring you these great people. And as we promised, Abedingo also joins us right now here on Church O'Clock Show. Maybe a bedding goes to Karibu Sana. Abasant. Unazangalele camera, Urushitu shout out at a salamu kwa to watch Tani. Ah, okay. Natak to Masalam kwa what? To Masabiki wangu, what? To Masalam kwa Muke wangu, my daughter. Mungu wa bariki sana. <laughs> Tell us about this name, Abedi Ngoso. Unajua, kuna mse, kwa chucha yuliza Ngoso, umse anajua Ngoso mingi sana. Lafa anashanga saizu mebonga sheng. Unajua, anashanga mebonga sheng. Tell us about Abedi Ngoso. Who is Abedi Ngoso? Abedi Ngoso is a name that, mm-hmm. ili na mtu anapewa, tuna wazazi. Uh-huh. Yeah, so, uh, I cannot say more. Abedi is a name, kama majina mingine. Abedi is a worship, kwa bibiria, ukendo angalia vizuri. Mm-hmm. Now I'm a worship actor, so Ngoso is uh, my daddy's name. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, Karibu Sana, and actually today uh, on Church O'Clock Show, we are talking about the, the topic of the day, and that we're asking a big question that who is God to me? Who is God to you? I believe Ngoso. When I was the camera, I was asking the same who is God really to you? Okay. Mungu ni yule na nintendea mambo ambao hawezi kani. For example, the way I am, as you see me, God has done something amazing upon me. First of all, number one, mm-hmm. the breathing, ile pumzi na pumua, is from God. Hiyo ni number one. <laughs> number two, me walking, coming here, going wherever I'm going, that's God. So, God is amazing. And who is Jesus Christ to you? <laughs> um, is, uh, Yesu ni mokozi wa maisha yangu. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm ambaye alinikomboa ambaye alinifia ambaye alinimwagia damu ambaye ambaye alikufa ili nipate uzima wa milele mm-hmm. yeah hey there you go amazing a very actually what i've learned you're very deep you know you're very yesu ni mokozi wa maisha yako the yes. savior of your life yes like hauna option nyingine hauna savior mwingine kwa hii dunia no ni yesu tu Yes. Na kwa ngoma fulani akitamwa anasema ni yesu tu ambaye anaweza kuokoa baba anyway Talking about the music, yes, sir. We, we, we have seen and we have marked a, a, a very good trend of worship and praise on your songs. Tell us about your music, your style. Uh, first of all, uh, uh, actually, um, number one, uh-huh. I, I'm a producer, my professional. Uh-huh. I'm, a, I'm doing music producer and uh, um, now doing for other people, I mean music for other people out there. Uh-huh. Uh, you know, in Vutia na mimi nikaingia sasa kufanya muziki because I was like, why am I doing other people's music? Mm-hmm. You know, and then I was like, ah, I can try to do my own music and nione mungu wata nipereka wapi. And then I started doing now, the, um, this song says, Yesu ndi, msaida wangu, wakaribu. Sometimes by like, it was um, 29 there. Mm-hmm. And when, when I released that song, people was like, man, that's a serious song. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, so God has give me, given, me, given me something to, you know, to preach to other people there. Mm-hmm. So I was like, let me continue. So from there, that's how my music came in mm-hmm. and Nikanza could release. Mm-hmm. Yes. And also, there's a song that in Menibamba that actually is in conjunction to our topic today. Yeah. The song Baba Muema. Baba Muema. Mm-hmm. Tell us about that song. Ulifayana. Karo, Karo, nice, Karo, nice, Karo, nice. Karo, nice. Oh, that, that, that song wasn't mine, actually. I uh-huh. was producing her song, and she was like, man, I, I like your voice. Can mm-hmm. you please do that part for me? Mm-hmm. I said, okay, Sawa. Mm-hmm. She didn't have that part. Mm-hmm. She came with another, I mean, her, that song, but I had now to sit down and create that part, mm-hmm. the verse, mm-hmm. and like a small chorus there. Mm-hmm. And then that's it. So she, that song is not mine, actually. I just helped her to do some little uh, voice there. Yes, yeah. but again, when I talk to Mzuri about uh, you, you artists like you people, the, the people who are giving content, good gospel content, actually to us teachers, and also we have learned about the song like songs like Uwezo, Emisi Uwezi, and also the, the song that you're going to do, maybe perform for us as we get to end this interview, Kimbilio. Tell yeah. us maybe brief brief story about the inspirations behind those songs. Uh, Kimbilio song um, mm-hmm. came in when uh, um, uh, uh, let me let me let me give a little bit my testimony. Um, 
Uh, I remember it was 2010 uh, when I got married. Mm -hmm. That's the time. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's the time. Uh, um, I, I thought everything when you get married, everything would be cool. Mm -hmm. But when I get in there, it was everything. crazy. <laughs> I, I, I didn't understand. I was asking God, God, mm -hmm. I don't know. Because mm -hmm. uh, when we f first got the, the first pregnancy, took a potesam toto a kwanza, took a potesam toto a piri, took a potesam toto a tattoo. I was like, hey, if, like every year when I try, I try again, I was, mm -hmm. now I had to sit down and ask myself, God, what did I, 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 I do wrong, you know? And then uh, I, I, I couldn't get the answer quick because, you know, what they started telling me, you know what, maybe you know, maybe, you know, the shetani anafanya mambo yake, you know, maybe you did, what one of kanyangia bibiria, usi prosper, you know, it was too much things there, but I had to sit down and, and think and talk to God. God gave me that song that kimbirio laki ni yesu peke yake, no matter what, hata kama imefika mwisho, but you have to press on. Mm -hmm. And then um, that's how actually um, when I lost the last baby uh, was 20, uh, 2014. Mm -hmm. It was very difficult for me. And that's how I came up with that song. I said, So I just, I just, God gave me the words and I wrote the song. I, did, I went to the, you know, studio and then I did it. Good point. God yeah. gave you the words. Yeah. You went to the studio and you did it. Maybe you can go to camera. Kuna msani, maybe you can go to the studio and you can go to the clock show. Maybe you can go to the studio and you can go to the studio. Maybe 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 you can go to the studio. I love how a bedding goes or does it. But what is the reason behind it? And you just told us that God gave you the words. Maybe you can go to the studio. Maybe you can go to the studio. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Actually, um, as a gospel artist, mm -hmm. you know, as a Christian, let me say that, let me put that way. You know, we go through a lot. Sometimes, you always part of Majibu. But let me tell you, because when I was going through hell that time, I couldn't get anybody to come and talk to me. But I thank God because he came in and, and, and he was like, he would bless me. When, when he was talking to me, you know, that time, I had to learn how I can uh, uh, listen from God. And then, Mungu alikuja kanizungumzia and I know let alone Mungu akanibariki. Right now as I'm talking to you, I have a beautiful baby girl. Now I know you're going through something. I don't know what you're going through right now, but I know if you put your trust in Jesus Christ, majibu yako yote iko mlangoni. Unagongewa hivi majibu unaingiziwa kwa nyumba yako. So the most important tayari Yesu alikufa msalabani because of you. You know to sanctify dambi and you mefanya makosa yote to sanctify whatever you're going through he's there he's the, he's the only uh, god he's the most high god so put your trust on, on the lord and on tegeme tu atafanya hakuna shida ngumu kwake every problem kwake ni kitu kidogo anasema 1000 days ama 1000 uh, um, siku ni kama one day kwake so, so that is impossible relax mm -hmm. tegemee bwana anaweza mambo yote